Welcome back to my channel. So today I have my June favorites for you. So I'm super excited because I've got some fun new favorites that I'm really excited to talk to you guys about. I just feel like super girly today. Like I'm wearing a dress and I self tanned. So like I'm not super pale. My hair is like curled and I don't know. It's just been a solid day and I feel cute. Anyways, let's go ahead and jump into my beauty favorites. So, first thing that I have been obsessed with in the month of June is the Unique Mascara. I used this, I think, in my last Get Ready With Me video, which was my, like, simple summer makeup. And this mascara is literally incredible. I'm sure you guys have probably heard about it because there are quite a few, like, <clears throat> demo, like, review-style videos on YouTube. Um, but like I said, I did use it in my last video if you guys were interested. Um, but I'm obsessed with this stuff. I have it on right now. It just it makes my lashes so incredible. I just love, like, doing that, like, a nice bronze eye with some bold, like, big, fluttery lashes and calling it good. And it's super easy to take off at the end of the night. So I have been obsessed with this no unique is not sponsoring me however I do have a friend who sells the stuff and she did give me this one for free so I'm very thankful to her because I am obsessed with this one and I did actually hear today on Facebook I saw that they're coming out with a new like they reformulated it and made it like even better so I'm really excited to get my hands on that one when it comes out and try that one out but seriously guys obsessed definitely recommend and of course if you are interested in the mascara I'll leave a link down below to her site to where you can order it if you want to try it yourself so moving on and next I have this is actually like really brand new to me but I am obsessed with it, it was like love at first use <laughs> but this is the NYX Tame and Frame Tinted Brow Pomade this is in the color blonde now I have used the Anastasia pomade before and that one worked really well but this color is just perfect it's like the best blonde shade I've ever seen it doesn't pull any certain color it doesn't look too brown obviously it doesn't have any red in it it's just a the like perfect neutral blonde shade. I have it on my brows today and I don't think they look crazy. Like they look natural, you know? And the pomade itself works so well. You don't have sharpie brows. It just looks so beautiful and natural and it's great for summer because pomades last like nobody's business. Next I have a cheek product. This is a blush. This is the Tarte 12 hour or the Amazonian Clay 12 hour blush in Exposed, which I think I mentioned on my channel once before and I know I've probably used it in a video, but this blush is beautiful. It's an like it's I can't even, I can't even get my like thoughts straight on it. I just am so in love with it. It's the perfect blush for every single day. And it just gives you that like, oh, I've been out in the sun, you know, doing whatever and I'm glowing like kind of look. So I love this blush. I use it almost every single day. So next I have a foundation. It's also from Tarte, which I didn't even realize that I had two Tarte products in here, but this is the Amazonian Clay Full Coverage Foundation. It's got SPF 15. I am in the shade Ivory and this foundation is just incredible for summertime. Like you probably wouldn't think that you want to wear like a full coverage foundation for summer because you know sometimes it just sweats off, but with where I work and I work like downtown, it's super hot. So this foundation lasts like, I mean, it's amazing. I can wear this for like 12 hours and sometimes I'm at work for that long, if not longer. So this stuff actually lasts all the way through and I can come home and I still look good. Next I have like a skincare product. This is the Simple Cleansing Micellar Water. It cleanses, removes makeup and hydrates. I typically just use like a makeup wipe to get my stuff off but I do really like having this at my vanity um, just to like put on a cotton pad and take off any excess makeup like on the back of my hand or like use a q-tip like if I have it on any like any smudges or anything on my eyes this stuff is really nice and I honestly was super skeptical because I don't know it just says micellar water which I don't really know what that means but it says water on it and I just figured that doesn't really sound like it's gonna remove much but this stuff is surprisingly like phenomenal. I love it. So highly recommend this as well if you guys can find it. I think I found mine at CVS if I remember correctly. So Simple is a really good line too because it's super super great for sensitive skin. So my next skin product is a self tanner. This is the Saint Tropez Self Tan Express. This is also kind of new to me. I bought it probably I think it was like three days ago actually and I self tanned twice with it already. 
I am in love. Probably like my favorite self tanner that I've used so far and I've used quite a few and most of them have actually been Saint Tropez and this one is just incredible. It's the one hour tan. So you can wear it for one hour and get like a light tan. You can wear it for two hours and get a medium tan or you can get it or you can wear it for three hours and get a dark tan. And I typically wear it for three hours um, and this is kind of like the tan I've gotten from doing it like twice. I don't know if it's gonna like show up super well on camera but I am wearing white today and I just look I just look super tan and I love it because I don't go out in the sun because the way my genetics are set up I just burn and I turn red as a lobster and then I peel and nothing comes of it <laughs> so self tanner is the only way I survive in the summer and this stuff is seriously amazing and it's so even like I don't have a single streak I well I mean obviously you want to make sure that you don't miss a spot because that would cause streaking and I've been very thorough other than my hand like look at this guys I don't know if you guys can see there we go my fingers are white and my hand is tan that was mainly my fault because the first night I self tanned I didn't get my fingers so that's all me. But seriously, no joke guys, highly recommend this. If you guys want like a review video on like which self tanners I recommend, just let me know in the comments below because I would love to do it for you guys. This is actually it for my beauty favorites. So I have a couple of other favorites. I can't remember if I mentioned this in my last month's video or if I just talked about it in like a recent video, but I have been obsessed with watching um, Amazon. I have Amazon Prime right now because I have like the 30 day free trial. And I've been obsessed with watching Awkward, and I just finished season four, like the, well, 402 or whatever. It's like part two of season four. And I, I cannot, like seriously. Jenna and Maddie need to be together. Like it's just, that's the only way I'm going to be okay is if they end up together. But anyways, I've been obsessed with that show and it's basically ruined my life. So of course all of my music favorites for the month of June will be listed down below. There will be a link to Spotify. But real quick, just a couple songs that I wanted to mention that I've been like seriously obsessed with this month. So Halsey, I discovered her in, well June, in last month. Um, and I've been addicted to a couple of her songs. Down is like yes every day and is there somewhere like those two songs I cannot stop listening to all of her songs are amazing I'm super excited about her new album um but those two songs I have been listening to non-stop well as Charlie Puth and like Megan Trainor's song Marvin Gaye that song is so catchy I think there was an entire day in June where that was the only song I listened to so Yellow Card which I know is kind of like I guess old school if you will but only one in Ocean Avenue are just classics and I've just been listening to them so often like I heard them at work like recently and I was like ah oh, yeah throwback perfect so yeah I hope you guys enjoyed this video thank you so so much for watching and I can't wait to talk to you in my next one bye guys